Hey guys, it's Kai here, and today is a day. Today is a day that I'm going to be piercing my septum. Sorry, I haven't been here on like a year. Um, I've been lazy, so pretty much I like watching piercing videos. So I thought I would make a piercing video for y'all, and I do have a few things I'm gonna say. This is when I'm just making an intro right now because um, I need to wait a few minutes before I can do it, so my parents are home. Yeah, I am sorry for not being here on like a year, but that's that's not the point. I'll be more active if y'all give me video ideas in the comments down below. If y'all want to see like a makeup tutorial, a, another piercing vid, tattoo vid, blah blah blah, whatever, I'm down. If you're down, bye for now. I'll be back. So I just wanted to say a few things before I actually pierce myself. So I'm not gonna be one of those bitches that are like, don't do this at home. I know you're gonna do this at home. I you're me okay you're me watching this and you're gonna do this at home that's your whole point of watching this video so let me tell you how you can be safe and correct doing it i've pierced my septum before it did not go well because i did not follow these steps okay my camera keeps falling just don't mind it I, sorry not my camera my phone okay my phone but it'll be okay okay so pretty much um first thing you need if you're gonna pierce your septum you need the septum clamp I will show you what those look like later on, but you need septum clamps. That's what I, that's where I went wrong the first time. It was crooked. It was horrible. Even if you think you have the steadiest hand, so did I, but the pain will make you like, it's bad. Okay. Anyways, second, you need a 16 gauge needle, professional piercing needle. You can get them off Amazon for so cheap. Might as well get the septum clamps. They can be plastic or metal, whatever you want. And the needles at the same time, just get a septum piercing kit off Amazon. They're like 10 bucks, not even. It's, it's worth it. It's better than safe piercing it with like a safety pin or something okay next um be clean just wash your hands you don't have to wear gloves i'm not gonna wear gloves even though i should some people are gonna come to me saying really should react to it no okay like you don't have to wear gloves as long as you keep your hands very very clean make sure everything is sterilized make sure everything is clean make sure the area is clean just make sure everything's clean and safe and i think that's it i think that is three things you really need for this i will tell you more as I'm doing it, I like, this isn't a tutorial by the way. I've done a lot of research, I've done a lot. So I do kind of know what I'm doing, but I, once again, I'm not a professional, but I'm not gonna tell you not to do this because I know you are. And yeah, so don't, I recommend watching more videos than just mine. Okay, so first things first, before I do anything, this is my box of tattoo and piercing stuff. <laughs> okay, so first I need to get everything out. So here are my bag of needles. I'm gonna get the gray ones, which are 16G. Sorry, I'm kind of going fast because my parents just left. I don't know how much time I have. Um, here are some sterile alcohol swabs. Let me get that out. Um, here is the jewelry I got from Spencer's. As I said, I pierced my septum before, so they're all like messed up, but I'm gonna use a silver one with little spikes in there. Then I'm gonna get the clamps out. I have metal septum clamps. They look like that on the end. I'll show you better when they're out of the package. And I think that's it. I'll just get stuff out right now. Sorry, I'm like kind of panicked. I'm like so excited but nervous at the same time, you know? So it's like, it's a lot. So here's the needle. 16G catheter needle. Pretty cute. Jewelry, titanium, clamps, alcohol, aftercare. You need to make sure you do aftercare. I'm so nervous. I'm so nervous. Okay. Okay, we're good, we're good. Oh, this is gonna be so cute. Okay, I'll be back. I'm gonna wash my hands and I'll be back. Now, I need another alcohol pad for my fingertips and my nose. Well, for the clamps, I guess. I'll use one for the clamps. Okay, I am a little bit snotty. I just, I'm getting over being sick. So this probably isn't the best one to do this anyway, but you know what, we're doing it. Okay, it says it already. this is already sterilized, but just in case, you know, I'm just gonna be very, specific with it. Okay, I'll use the same one to do my fingertips. Okay, sorry, I'm just, I'm so scared, you guys, so scared. Next is the needle. So this is what the needle looks like. It's 16G, it's like a fader needle. Okay, now I'm just gonna wipe the needle down too. Okay, we're gonna do this. I'm gonna turn towards the mirror because that's more important than the YouTube video. Making sure. Oh, I forgot to clean the inside. Oh my God, what am I doing? Okay, we're gonna clean and then we'll clean the outside too. 
you're all around the nostrils and everything okay now we're gonna get the clamps and it has like a hang on So everyone says the clamps hurt more than the actual piercing, and I think that's gonna be true for this. So. Okay, that's my sweet spot. Okay, I found my sweet spot. And then like maybe a little bit higher. No, I think like right there is good. Okay, my eyes are already watering. I haven't even pierced myself yet. So it's like the clamp is inside my nose right now, but that's definitely my sweet spot. That is it. Yeah, that's definitely it. Yeah. <gasps> oh. Huh? I need to lift up my nose so it doesn't prick through. Oh, okay, I did it. Oh, I did it. I just did it. Okay, purr. Get this needle out. Now that's straight. That's straight. Okay, um, thank you, God, for letting this be straight. Do you see how many tears are going down, though? I didn't even feel the piercing that much after these fucking clamps, bitch. I swear to God. Okay. Okay, let's see if this bitch is straight. It is. Oh my god, it's straight. Okay. Now, the jewelry. Okay, now this might be the bad part. So, what you can see, I'm just putting it in here. No, it's bleeding. It's bleeding. Okay. I really hope it's not my fucking parents. That'd be awkward. I'm gonna screw this little baby on. Sorry, I'm just getting all the blood. Don't mind me. It's really not that painful, you guys. I swear to God. It's it's just blood. I'm telling you, do not be afraid to do this. It's, it wasn't that bad. I swear to God, the clamps hurt way worse than the freaking piercing did, and that's weird. And I did get my reaction to the piercing, and I was kind of, you know, loud about it, but it's gonna be okay. Okay, it's literally straight though. Like, it's literally straight. Oh my god, it's so cute! Wait, 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 is it straight? Oh my god, this is what a straight septum piercing looks like. No, because it's literally straight. Like, this is literally, like, professional. Minus the blood. Okay. I think I pierced it in the right spot too. Okay, purr. So I need to need to clean up the blood a little bit more. Well, actually, you know what? I'm gonna get a, a dry Q-tip and I'm just gonna like casually do this. And then I'm gonna get a Q-tip. I'm gonna spray it with this, okay? And I'm gonna wipe down the whole area of it. Sorry, I'm not doing a very good job at showing y'all what's going on. But like right now I'm kind of in like shock that I just did that, you know? So per, I guess. No YOLO, you only live once and that's, and you have one body and you might as well make it swag. If forward, I think it looks really good. Like, I think it looks like it's always been there. Like I swear to God, but like not at all. You know, it's like, it's different. It's different, but it's like meant to be. Here. Hopefully I got a good thumbnail photo out of that. Okay, but yeah, love that for me. Okay, well, bye, I guess. <laughs> Remember, if you're gonna do this, don't do it like I did. Don't panic as much. I don't know why I was panicking so much, but yeah, just do it safely like I did, but I recommend doing even more research and doing even safer than I did because I was freaking out about the sweet spot for like 10 minutes. So that's cool. I'm gonna clean it a little bit more and then I'm just gonna clean up around and then I'll be done. So yeah, and then I'm just gonna wait for my pants reaction. So per, okay, anyways, bye bye Okay, so it's been a little bit and there's a few things I want to say about the video. I was just like reviewing the footage, you know? And I'm sorry for one, the bad editing. I'm sorry for two, the chaotic energy. And three, um, I love it. I love it. So I'm saying if you're thinking about it, do it. Also, I didn't film a proper outro, so if you like the video, leave a like. If you like me, please subscribe and hit that bell notification. My socials are in the description down below, and um, you should follow me on Instagram because I'm really hot on Instagram, and add my snap too because I'm way more active on there, and yeah, so tea.